Hello people of the internet. I hope you're doing well wherever you are in the world. My name is Shulani Baloyi and if you're coming for the first time I just want to welcome you here. If you're returning, thank you so much for keep that you keep coming over and over. Uh, guys, <laughs> today's vlog is one exciting vlog. Just make, trying to make sure that um, I don't get caught while not wearing, not wearing this mask. Um, today's vlog is a special one because drum rolls we have made it we have made it we are on our third country so i'm in malta today and um we are now i'm just like kind of currently trying to explore this place and i am at fort st angelo the place where game of thrones was shot so for the people who are like game of thrones fanatics this is it this is it i am taking you through what happened and everything in detail so yeah let's go there and then I'll show you everything. So I think this place is like turned into a museum or something, or I don't know if it was already a museum when Game of Thrones. Listen, I'm not a Game of Thrones fanatic, right? But like, I was just like, I'm here, so let's go. If, if it's not for me, it's for the people that follows me that are actually fans of Game of Thrones. So let's go. Let's go to explore this place in Malta. So before I go there, just like on the other side, you have like your yachts and everything. It looks a bit quiet, so I don't know if it's like resident yachts where people just basically have their own yachts and they stay here. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, um, just to give a glimpse of what's going on where i am right now it must be nice to actually own this kind of a huge yacht like this uh but yeah this is like a bit of a just a bit of a snippet of the place i'm at and i'm gonna go up now so this there is where i'm gonna go i'm gonna go there and see from the inside it's really quiet and I think one thing I'm not really liking the most is the fact that I have to wear this mask the whole time. Um, in Vienna, that's not the thing. When I'm in public like this, I don't have to wear a mask. So I guess the regulations are different for different people. Uh, but yeah, this is more like it. This is how I'm, a, I'm experiencing my 30th country. We are on 30 country or rather 30th country of 30 and it's going well so far it's really going well so yep this is where we are so yeah it's a heritage site and you have a reception audio guides as well and yep Fort St. Angelo and let's go in let's go in so yeah i think those are the prices so they actually don't So, okay, update. I actually, oof, the sun is playing with us. It comes out and then it moves and then it ruins the video quality and everything. Uh, but apparently, the place where Game of Thrones is shot is not open for, for the public. Um, that's what I was told. So it's not really open for the public. So unfortunately, I am not able to see that. Um, I'm sad about that part. Not because I care about Game of Thrones, but because I would have loved to see it. Um, it was really special. Uh, I mean, considering the fact that a lot of people love Game of Thrones. So there must be something 
here, but I'm continuing to explore the place. It's uh, very much a prehistoric um, heritage site. And yeah, let's continue. I'm just going to show you. stealing something from the outside when you are I guess that looks more exciting than being on the heritage site so maybe I should also go to the harbour and just go on a cruise the cruise might be more exciting and yeah
City, Valletta, and I'm just gonna show you. I'm turning the camera now to show you just the glimpse of it, um, and then I'm gonna go to Republic Street. Frankly, it's like the busiest shopping street that you should at least visit when you are in Valletta, or rather when you when you're in Malta. So yeah. Let me turn the camera and show you just snippets of the letter and then we can walk to Republic Street because it's like 8 minutes away from here walking The weather is very much complicated one minute is warm, the next it's cold, you need your jacket, and the next it's windy. It rained at some points today, so I guess it's such a very, very moody weather. But we are okay with it either way.
so yeah this is it i am now gonna walk to i'm gonna walk to, to, to the to republic street and see how that's like and the last thing i'll do is dinner i'll do dinner next then we're good we're good for the day arrived at the uh, Republic Street I hope you guys can hear me with this mask on uh, but yeah we are now at the Republic Street and as you can see it's quite busy not too busy but like quite busy um, there's people moving around back and forth uh, it looks vibey and all and exciting and musical as well so yeah this is the Republic I'm gonna turn the camera again and so you can see the Republic Street because again I am not that interesting so let's go the Republic yo Republic Street there's literally a man who's singing so beautifully I'm just gonna turn the camera again he's singing really beautiful